Hello everyone and welcome back to another update video. I'm very very excited for this update. Um, we have some new Ackle Techies, round two of them, the last round, so I'm very very excited so let's get right in. As usual I'm going to read a little bit about the update and then we'll go check them out. So this week's update is called Three Shiny Ackle Techies. New Horses at Silverglade Vineyard the newly renovated stables at Silverglade Vineyard are already coming to good use. Three new Ackle Techies just arrived there and they're impatiently waiting for a new two-legged friend. The Silverly Buckskin, the Cremello, and the Dark Dapple Grey all go for 850 Star Queens each and you can get one of your very own if you have reached at level if you had reached at least level 13 and I'll put a little picture of two of them on the screen right now it's from their news page and i think it's time to go check them out very very excited so let's go okay so it looks like the first one is right here and it looks amazing so here it is right here as you can see i unfortunately do not have enough star coins to be able to buy one but next month since it's my birthday in july um, there will be um, a double star coins weekend since there's usually one every month. I know I think there's one just last week, but for the one for July, I'm definitely gonna get some star coins. So hopefully then I'll be able to buy um, these ones because this one I think like I love it so so much. Um, so yeah, I don't have quite enough to buy one of them, but I'll definitely want to buy at least one of them um, when I get more star coins. So let's take a closer look at this one. It is absolutely beautiful. So this one I think is a silverly buckskin. At first I thought it was like kind of like a gray, but they call it a buckskin, silverly buckskin. The eyes are beautiful and I love the big face marking. And it has, yeah, a beautiful coat. So I love this one so, so much. I'll definitely want to get it once I have more star coins. So I'll save this one for next month will be one of my birthday horses. And yeah, I don't kind of like the track where they have kind of similar coat colors. Um, but yeah, that's the first one. It looks like a lot of people are over here checking out this one. And it is beautiful. A lot of people are here, so let's see. Look at, let's look at this one. Ooh, look at these. This one. I can't really see it well. There's so many people here. Okay, so it has brown eyes very beautiful i think this one is the dapple gray let me just um double check dark dapple gray that's what they call it it is very beautiful and it has those socks there and the tail and the mane it's kind of this light brownish color at the end which adds a nice detail i don't mind that so that's that one, very beautiful. I'll probably end up getting that one too. Let's get back on my horse. It looks like this one is popular. Look how many people are there. Oh, and here's the last one. Oh my gosh, this one is beautiful too. I'll have to end up getting all of them next month for my birthday. Um, but yeah, here's this one. It reminds me of the one I already have at my home stable. Again, blue eyes. Little uh, face marking there. That's really nice. And here it is. It has some white socks. Um, yeah, this is this one. Love this one too. Um, so yeah, those are all three of the new Ackle Techies. Again, unfortunately, I can't buy one. Don't have quite enough um, star coins, but hopefully, one of you can get one or whatever one you like. They are beautiful. So great job, Star Stable Team. I love them so so much. So I think that is it for those horses. They're again, they're all here at the Silverglade Vineyard. Um, you have to be at least level 13. So that is it for that update. The next update is called Ceremonial Dresses. Sometimes you might want to dress up for some special occasion and it might be happy or sad. In the Yorvik City Mall, you might, I mean, you will now be able to find suit jackets in black and white as well as two types of dresses with beautiful lace I'll put a picture on the screen right now. Looking at the picture, they look pretty nice. So they said they're at the Yorvik City Mall, so let's go see them. I think I'm going to take the trailer set, it's going to be shorter. 
and yeah. Okay, so we're at the bus stop for the mall, and the road is black, um, but there's an easy way to fix it. If you didn't know it, you just click this little button here, the main menu, and click options, and then go to graphics and turn your shadows. If you want them off, just click it once, but if you want them on, you click it twice, and that fixes the problem right away. It's just a little thing you have to do, and yeah, so we're going to go to the Yorbic City Mall, and there um, yeah, they're at the clothes shop, so yeah, let's go see them. Okay, we were here, so I'm just gonna close that. Um, let's see if we could get a better view. Okay, that is zoomed in more. So the first thing is called Chick Black Blazer. This looks pretty nice, fancy. It is writing eight, so it is full stats, but the price. Um, it is only star coins and it's 165. That is super overpriced. I mean, it does look very nice, good stats, but you can't even use your Yorbic shillings. And 165, that is a lot. So, of course, I'm not going to be buying it. Um, and then they have a white version of this. And they have some. Um, these pants. These pants, again, only star coins, max stat, but the price, 140 star coins for just these pants. That is a lot. That is, that is more than you get for, um, you know, like your weekly thing of star coins. Like you get 100 every week of your lifetime, and this is even more. So these are really overpriced. I know they're like fancy and everything, but a little overpriced. And then they have the white version of this. Again, max stats, 140 star coins. And then they have this beautiful dress. I love it a lot. 165 star coins, riding eight. And then they have a black version of this. So I think that's it for the thing. I think that's it. So yeah, they just have these jackets and then pants, black or white, and then the dress. They are beautiful, everything. I love it. But a lot, really, the only thing that you could buy with the Yorvik shillings, if you want to know, is this black dress except it's 9,900 so it's almost like the maximum you could get so you really you would really have to like save up or sell a lot of things to get it but it does look very nice and I don't know if I could go into like more views or if anything I think this one's the best but that is I think all of the new clothes I don't think they put anything in the um in the tax shop so I think that is um, it's for the new clothes. I'm going to quickly get out of here because there's some people. Um, and, um, yeah, I just want to read a little bit more just to make sure there isn't, um, anything I'm missing here at the mall so you don't, I don't have to go back here again. Um, the next update says shopping tweaks. We made a few tweaks to the shopping experience in the game. From now on, you'll be able to buy several pieces of each horse item at any time as it'll not disappear from the shops when you've bought them okay but you just you need to make sure you don't buy like double of anything um i liked it before because you know like you wouldn't have the thing of like buying it twice but now i guess um you can buy it how many times you want so you just have to be careful not to buy the same thing twice but like for your horse if you don't want to have to keep dragging the same gear out of it you could buy it for multiple horses I guess that could be useful if you hover above an item in the shop you will see a text telling you if you already oh oh okay this makes a lot of sense okay I should have read more if you hover above an item in a shop you will see a text telling you if you already own the item so that is useful um, that I was just wondering about that so there won't be the chance, you, like, it will tell you if you already have the item. Unless you want it again, you can get it again. But if you already have it, it'll tell you. Okay, that's good. Um, so you can choose for yourself if you want more of it to use for several of your horses. Handy. This will be even more noticeable in the future as we are currently 
as we currently are doing some difficult code work with our shops. When we're done, the shops will be easier to use and also will look better than they already do. Okay, um, and now to the little part to the update. Rainbow Festival is available for one more week, so if you haven't gotten the full outfit, you can get it for one more week, so make sure you do it if you haven't done it. Cloud Kingdom also, one more week, so make sure to do that if you haven't. Horse Market is open at Yorvik Stables Arena for this week, and coming next week, they've been doing these a lot, like a little sneak peek about what's coming next week. As we're entering June, the Drivians are starting to hype up the great summer tradition of Midsummer. I love Midsummer Festival. It always seems to be in June, because it's, you know, it's the start of summer. I can't wait for that. Last year's Midsummer Festival was amazing. I loved it so much. So, yeah, maybe they changed a little bit of it. Um, but yeah, I can't wait for Midsummer, so that is next week. While the preparations are filled with joy and happiness, the Druids are in rather me mellow mood as they're moving towards Doyle's Abbey. Yeah, I don't know what that means. Maybe those new clothes in the mall will be use will be of use sooner than you think. Oh, I don't know what that little thing means. Talking about the druids, is there gonna be like Soul Rider quests coming up? Like story quests, I mean. I don't know. But that is it for this week's update. Um, I think I should end on my horse, so I'm going to go to the outro, so yeah. So yeah, I think that is it for this week's update. I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time for another video. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. As always, don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on notifications, and ring the bell so you never miss out on a video that I'll make. Um, and yeah, I'll see you soon. Bye.